God is good, and for each day that passes brings us a day closer to the launch of Pantheon Rise of the Fallen. Thanks for joining me today, guys. We're going to play some more Vanguard. Uh, haven't played since a little bit earlier last week. It's time to dive back in. Let me get my screen pulled up here for you guys so you can see it. Hello, chat. Welcome to some more Vanguard. This is a really good game, and uh, something I discovered yesterday is this town right here. Uh, where are we? Um, right here, Renton Keep. Uh, this is a great place to go because if you hang out here, your awareness score levels up like crazy for some reason. So if you want your awareness to go up, come chill out and go AFK right here in Renton Keep. That's in the, what's it, the Three Rivers area. Glad you finally got to catch us live, Nell. Good to see you. Big Red, welcome. And I agree, Vanguard is good, but God is better, and Pantheon is coming soon. Couldn't have said it better myself. What's up, Rayco? Welcome, welcome. What's the takeaway? How you doing? Uh, I love that emoji of uh, uh, Mikkel, no beans Mikkel, or 
No Tell Mikkel. For anybody that watched the last uh, stream with uh, the the developers in which they tried to get rid of the Ben No Beans Dean by him using his Mikkel name. So that is No Tell Mikkel. Um, welcome, welcome, and hey, what's up, Steven? Uh, I, I'm not sure what I'm going to end up doing tonight, to be honest. I, I just logged on, and we're going to play. And whatever happens, happens. That's the way we're going to do this. The game has been running a little laggier than normal. Um, there's a little bit more of a stutter than there was in my previous game sessions, because I played some yesterday. And what was really cool about yesterday was Ronick joined us and joined the Knights of Napalm. That's right, the Ronick. I'm really proud that I have a member of the development team right here in the in the night in the Knights of Napalm. I'm very proud of that. Uh, so he he's you know he's not gonna play hardcore or anything, but this is a great game for the development team to play while they're working on Pantheon. And hey JNL, welcome again to another stream of Pantheon. Everybody's kind of filtering in. Uh, just want to say once again, I don't know what I'll be doing today. But we'll do something. And I do want to show you, actually, uh, before uh, a group gets going or anything like that, if that even happens tonight, let me see if we can't just find something cool in the world, just so I can kind of show you what it's like to solo in Vanguard. Once again, for anybody joining this that has not watched the previous Vanguard streams, I uh, just want to mention that this is an emulator server. And this server is an alpha, still has some bugs, has some things that don't work. See, see what I mean? I'm, that, I think I actually, I think that time I entered a new chunk. Uh, but it's not perfect, okay? So don't come into the world expecting it to be done. There's still plenty to do as far as development of the server goes. But also there's still plenty to do for us to have fun, in my opinion. Plenty to do. Okay, there's a three... I'm going to pull this guy. Got to warm up, too, because I haven't played since last week. So let's see. By myself. I'm kind of kicking his butt here. I think I got a couple of crits off there early, though. Yes, uh, what's the takeaway? He sure did. Super awesome and proud to say that Ronick did join my guild last night. Uh, the big troll in the pond. Sure, let's see if we can find that. Let me get back on my trusty uh, cheat, cheating flying uh, mount here, and let me get a little. Let me get a little bit airborne so I can see the pond you're talking about. I didn't notice it. Go a little bit further up in the sky. There's a couple of ponds nearby. Um, there's one really close right up here. I wonder if this is the one you're talking about. Entering this chunk. It's going to take a second to load here. There we go. I wonder if that's the one you're talking about that I'm headed towards. Uh, it's a couple of guys. Um, Jackal is one of the guys running the server, or at least one of the GMs. And um, there's a few of them. Uh, apparently, they used to do an EQ2 emulator server. Uh, is where they got their experience from. This might be a little big to be a pawn. This might not be what you're talking about. Since it's a big troll. Yeah, we may... Uh, hopefully we do get another dungeon going. We probably will. What is that? That is cool looking. Let's see what we got here. This is definitely a quest or something. You see this? It's like the northern lights right here. Very, very interesting. What is on that? A tiny little, tiny little creature. A fairy. It's a fairy on those rocks. Okay, so I don't think this was the pond you're talking about. So let me zoom out a little bit here. Let's try over here, see if we see if he's over there. I think I know what you're talking about. I actually I do know what you're talking about, and I am headed the right way now. And he'll probably kick my butt, because I think he's like level 25. That's okay. 
Let's see what he's got. Let's see how hard he beats me. Entering this chunk again. Alright, here we go. It should be right up here. Nice, Keenan. Got the got the notification right when I went live. Um Remy D asked, what's the population been? Uh, with my guild, it's been running somewhere around 30 to 50. Uh, so, good enough for you to hop in and, and, and get in the guild chat and find a group and find something fun to do. But definitely not uh, definitely not people everywhere, right? Like, pretty low population. And, and, and the, to be honest, the server's built in such a way that you can enjoy the game without a high population. Everything's toned down. They don't have everything working yet, so... A lot of the resistances and, and, and the crits and all that kind of thing work for you, but not but the uh, but the mobs can't do them. So uh, it kind of works out. This was not the pond with the troll. I could have sworn that was it right there near that uh, level 20, 25. So I'm not sure I know which pond you were talking about with the uh, troll. Is this it? Taj, I'm headed right for it. Is this the one? I'm gonna get an invite out. Nope. Let's see. Okay, we'll just look around then while I'm waiting on the group to get together to look for this troll. Tad says he remembers Solo and the troll and his necro back in the day. We seen them, man, but um, I, I think I might actually be talking about something different than what you are. We seen a, a big troll. Uh, it was around level 25 in one of the uh, live streams I was doing. We were killing something down below it. You could kind of see them up on the hill roaming about. But that might have been a different thing. All right, looks like we got a rogue joining. We got a coin, who we've been playing with the past couple of nights. I'll get him in voice chat right here in a second. Yep, he may not be. Uh, he may not be roaming about these days in this area anyway. Figure out where we're gonna go. All right, so it looks like we're gonna try to do Tome of Lord Sang. Which I have been wanting to see that dungeon really bad. So we'll have to run, we'll have to do a few quests to unlock it from what I understand. Let me get over here so I can port because I can't remember where that was, but I, I, it wasn't even this uh, continent. It was the, uh, I think I'll remember it when I see it. Oh, I got a mob on me. Yes, Matthew, there is a server going. It's an emulation server. 
Um, it's not perfect, man, but it's a lot of fun. There's a there's enough working in this game to have a blast and explore the world and do some dungeons and all kinds of good stuff. All the features aren't here, but a lot of them are. There's Reiko. If I get him to join. To join us, Reiko. Oh, I bowed to the dead wasp. There we go. Let's see if we can teleport. Why is it not working? Is this not a teleport stone like I thought it was? Nope, this is a rift. There we go. Alright, so we need to go... What was it? Is it... We see the name. So he's Tar Janishir, Temple of Dalyu. Yeah, this is it. This is it. Oh, it is coaching. My bad. I was wrong. That's right. It, yeah, that's right. It was this one. So here we go. We'll go to the Tomb of Lord Sang. So we're switching continents, guys. I would like to try the Blood Mage Hiller, I think. Yes, the, the Blood Mage Hiller is a really good option, man. Uh, I've never played one, but I know it's one of those classes everybody talks about. Oh, whoops. What was it called? Uh, what level is Zania? Oh, perfect. They want to play with this perfect level. Being a picture, I'll probably jump on. I still need to relearn my abilities. Been pretty much roaming around in busy old places. And this server is awesome for that. Damn, yeah, a guild invite. Uh, Alan Stansberry. My name in the game is right here. Nathan Napalm. And actually, if you slash three, which is world chat, you can generally just say, hey, I'm looking for an invite to the uh, Napalm Guild, to the Knights of Napalm. And there's usually a recorder, recruiter online that can get you uh, right in. Uh, Aaron asked what the server population is low, man. Um, it's been better since I've been streaming it. A lot of people started playing, so it's getting a lot better, but it's still low. Like, I, I, I didn't pay a whole lot of attention, but I think when I logged in just now, there was like 40 or so, something like that, 30 to 40 people. That's generally how it's been. Uh, I've seen it get up to 50, 60s. Um, it's not a huge population. Good thing is, is almost everybody that's playing is in the Knights of Napalm. So you join the guild and you can you can guild chat and usually find a group pretty fast. I did see that zoo. I saw that on my way home from work. Um, so uh, he's saying uh, the question on Twitter from uh, the Pantheon team uh, about raid sizes. Uh, I don't think there should be a limit on raid sizes. Uh, I think I liked it back in the day, uh, like in Dark Age of Camelot, which had a, you know, wasn't known for raiding or anything, but it had raids, uh, PVE raids, and uh, you just kind of got as many people as you could, and you tried to go do what you could do with it. Um, I don't even think they had scaling or anything. It was just the bosses were really freaking hard, so the more people you got, the easier it was, and it, and it still wouldn't be easy. Uh, so I, I don't know. I, I think there's. Uh, there needs to be checks and balances today. People play a lot more uh, along with the meta today. So uh, you got to be more careful uh, because I, I just don't think you get away with that, just allowing any group size anymore. 
Uh, but if it's open world, then you got to check and balance that because people are going to do that. So if you design it for uh, 32 people, let's say, or 24 man, um, 60 to 80 to 100 people might show up and just slaughter it. So they've already talked about that and that they're going to have systems in place to not allow that to happen. But me personally, I don't care, man. I think... Uh, I think there should be different types of content for different types of group sizes, right? As far as raids go. There should be uh, 12 man. There should be a 24 man, uh, 32, whatever. Uh, but they should have some that is pretty epic, right? Like some uh, world announced event raids kind of thing that, that are just massive. You know, just tons of people. Which is really rough on a server, by the way. So most developers don't really like that. But I think it's fun. Me hop in the Discord. So I can talk to these fine folks in the group. Just a second. Let me hop in here with them. Hey, what's going on, man? Can you hear me? Oh, now. Sorry, I had it on mute. What's up, man? Hey, man. Living the dream. That's right. Do you have, uh, like a hotkey or anything to give Zy and, uh, the Discord info? Or uh, yeah, I can get it right now. Let's see. You want me to ask in uh, Guild if two more people want to come? Or do you have somebody yeah. coming? Uh, yeah, you can ask. I don't have anybody else cool. coming. Freaking, uh... It's not... I think we should... I, I, I'm... Because I'm streaming, I really can't get the info. It's... It, okay, it hides see it. I it out. I can put that, but after we play tonight, I can add that to the message of the day so everybody can have it. Let me get my What's going on, up. gentlemen? Hey, hey, hey. I'm looking in here trying to figure out the uh, Discord info to give to. What's her name? Zyana. Okay. Um. Zay O eight three one. There we go. All right, Griffith said he'll be joining us after dinner. Very nice. Disciples are OP, GNL. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello. 
Uh, Pyway says he's having trouble getting the client to download. I don't know, man. You shouldn't shouldn't have any problems. I mean, it's a straight download. Uh, you do have to unzip it, of course, using something like 7-Zip or something like that after you download it. Um, could be a firewall. I don't know, man. Something going on on your end. So are we going to are we going to go straight to the uh, Lord saying and just see if we can go in? Yeah, I say we skip a sense and just fight our way in. See what happens. See what happens. Yep. I can't like when I pull up that they put in there as their handle for Discord. It's saying no one found. Yeah, I couldn't get to work either. I tried. You made it. All right. We're in. Everybody's in. Yeah, it's just head to tune. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're headed to uh, a dungeon I've actually been looking forward to since I started playing uh, on the emulator server. Because I actually read where um, somebody was talking about it was their favorite dungeon of all time. The thing about your favorite dungeon of all time, though, is a lot of times it has to do with the memories that you had in the dungeon. Um, but, of course, you're not going to have really good memories in a dungeon unless it's designed really cool. So... I know I had dungeons that I look back fondly of, and I went back and played them recently and was like wow this isn't even that great of a dungeon it's just i had a really good time here you know with other people lord guck dead and live side yeah gut man brutal that guck actually just makes me be afraid it, uh, it brings back memories of fear So this is the formal. This was flyer mounts. You can cheat. Why that? All right, cool deal. All right, I'm gonna start pulling. Uh, we don't have buffs up. Um, let me grab a couple of mine that I have. I can pull. I am ranged. Uh, try it. Let's see. Oh, these could be big to us too. You gotta be careful. Yes. Yeah, let me pull the aggro. The the threat in this is a little rough. A little rough. Okay. Wait, what race are, or what class are you, Coin? Oh, uh, this is a rogue. Okay, okay, okay. Is there a show target of target? Um, so what you can do to get where I think you're going is you can make uh, Nathan your defensive target. Pl press F and that'll assist. Okay, awesome. Thanks. Yep. <laughs> Heavy Metal asks how this game's been going. Uh, awesome, man. I think it's awesome. It's not. It's a, It's an alpha server. So, you know, you got to uh, keep your expectations in check. But I love it. I don't know where this guy came from. Respawn. Yeah, they respawn quick. Wow. Yeah, it came up on the healer. Fun stuff. Yeah, really fast. That guy at the bottom already respawned too. Yeah, so we need to. Got to keep moving. Gotta move. <laughs> yeah. Move forward or die. 
It's okay, it'll help me with my situational awareness practice, you know? This would be even more brutal if they had all their, uh... All their abilities. Yeah. Oh, what is this? That's interesting. This is closed off. Can we not go in? Oh nope. no, it's gated! Gate I don't, I don't think we go in. We didn't pay our HOA fees. I can uh, look up what we need to do real quick. Oh, I know how to. We just uh, go up, up here. We just need to what? Go up. Oh, we can fly up? Well, I th don't quote me, but I think you can go up around the, the outside edge here and then go up. And if we go over there and there's not a stairwell, we can fly. But I'm fairly certain. This way. Yep, I'm right. This way. Oh, I thought we were flying up. My bad. It's a four dot. Yeah, nice. Taking a little bit of damage. Four levels over is five dot. It's all right. I'm gonna wish I broke my sign assist. That's alright. Yeah. Yeah, I might be switching over to my wizard. I don't mean I don't mean today, I just mean in general. Yeah. On the sword? Oh, sword? My sork, yeah. So I have a sork also, and there's one of the reaction chains. Or is it reaction counter? I can't remember if it's a counter or a change. That's pretty instrumental. That basically duplicates your last spell. That's not in yet. That's why I'm not playing that one. Normal base. Does it... I guess that seriously hampers your DPS output? Uh, uh, I would say it makes a difference, but it's still a fun class to play as is. As it stands, I'm enjoying, enjoying my Druid more. Yeah, Druids are rad. Yeah. I like how they're, they're straight casters in this game rather than healers. Yeah, my highest in live was a Druid. Oh, really? Cool. Where can you get in on this, Odin? Uh, this is a, uh, it's a private server. Uh, it's the only one for Vanguard. Uh, Vanguard uh, Emu. And I actually have a video um, called Vanguard Rally Up that has all the information you need to uh, get going and download and start playing. Yeah, G now. This is gonna be a. Uh, it's gonna be a little different than the other dungeons where we just slapped our way right through it, which is good. Be a lot more fun, I think. You 
screw if I'm getting multi pulls. So are we gonna drop in or? No, no, no. We want to go uh, left and up here. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm actually gonna pull this guy and this guy around the corner because of uh, all those guys are gonna come. Oh crap! Now we got three. <laughs> Oh snap, they did come back. Look, they're all on him. Oh no, they're snap. They're all gonna be on the disable. They came back too quick. Yeah. Leroy Jenkins? Leroy Napalm! Exactly what I was trying to avoid happening. Ah, oh, it just makes it more fun. Yeah. We're surviving. Uh, Zay's got a lot of aggro on, though. I can't peel them off. Disciples. That's the life of a disciple. Yeah, disciples always steal the aggro. Got one peeled off. There we go. Good job, guys. Good recovery. Uh, yeah, wow. Wild Relic, I got this cape from beating the very first, uh... Hey, there's a really good gloves right there for a caster, guys. Yeah. Uh, I got this cape from just beating the, uh, uh the Isles of Dawn. The, the there's a big area. bat up top, be careful. Ah! <laughs> Most of what I'm doing is missing. Wait till we get to the bigger ones. I figured we should do something above our level. Yeah, that's a nice. Yeah, this is this is more fun. Yeah. I agree, Disrupt. He said it. Uh oh, we got another one. We're gonna go up and around to the front of this little here. Up there? This way. Oh, okay. We'll go inside, inside. There's stuff up. This is. So, like, if you look over here, you think these open, but only the one at the very front does. Now, there's a quest line that brings you in here, but I figured we could just go in there. Yeah. Look around, kill things. Yeah, just it. explore, yeah. Anybody, uh, anybody in the... Discord with me that knows anything about necros? A, a little bit, not not like a the master of necros. What are, what are they like in this game? I'm pretty much the the traditional necro, very OP, great solar at single targets. Um, I, you know I don't fully understand it, but there's things called grafts, and it's like equipment for your pets. Oh wow! You're like taking pieces of corpse and it kind of is additive. I I don't fully understand it. Whoa, dude! I I, I, I could be wrong, but I, I don't know if those work fully. Are you guys? I, I don't know if they're fully in front. I'm going down. Now by we gotta myself. wait for the next round. Yes, don't die. All right, I'll wait for you. But I can say I played from launch day and was getting server first. The cool first dungeon. The guy ever to hit level fifty was a guy named Polka Dots. <laughs> you necro with his pets. <laughs> Heard that. Oh, yeah. They're... I've it... played one to, what, level 24 on the emulator so far? And uh, very, very nice, especially on single massive. I, I gotta Sorry, say, if, if your game, if the uh, first person to hit max is not a necro and you had necros in your game, you're, something's wrong. That really should be the first class to hit max. Yeah, if they do a lot of outside grinding, I was definitely... Look how cool those look, dude! Oh, yeah. 
I really like this time. It may not be the best, but for a, like a, look, everything here is about level 20-ish. For a level 20 dungeon this early in the game, this is, this is nice. Yeah, it's a level 20 dungeon, man. This is cool. Uh oh, oh, trap, 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 trap. I don't know what happened, but definitely felt like a trap. No, that was me. Oh. <laughs> Danger. Oh, and by the way, Matthew says thank you for the necro information. I I enjoyed it up to 24. So, like, if you you look at what are the potentially the three best solo classes, disciple, what called dread knight, I think in this game, uh, necro and shaman. I played each one to 24, took them to a, a, the same dungeon and just to see who I could grind in deep with. When it got to multi targets, the necro kind of fell a little bit behind um, but single targets nothing could nothing could outdo it yeah I'm gonna pull over here this side of the room because of those pops we're gonna start coming yeah. back Go to this corner over here, guys. They actually do pretty decent single tag, uh, target damage when you're fighting low level stuff. But, uh, I'm rural, like everything else, the claim to fame is the dots. Oh, add through the wall. You get those dots on there with a bigger mob that's definitely a group mob outside. You just go to town. Yeah, I gotta agree now. It is weird that it is it is very always was strange to me that World of Warcraft never did a necro, being how popular necros were in um in Diablo. Uh maybe it was lore reasons? Is that just not a part of the lore? Is Warlocks is that like the necro in that lore, maybe? I really don't know. I don't know much about Warcraft. Did they have like a Lich King or something? Yeah. Was he a necro? But he, yeah, I would assume so. I really don't know much, guys, about World of Warcraft. Uh, we got an Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to keep moving forward or die. So the really cool thing about this dungeon, I haven't done them me later, don't fully in, um, but there's uh, weapons quests that provide really good orange weapons for this level. You run away from your quest in here. Very cool looking. Got two coming. We're gonna get the mummy whatever guy. Right.
So six is the max for group size in this, right? Yes. Yeah, hopefully we can knock this guy out quick enough and I'll, uh, I'll run over to that corner in the right. Before these start popping and end up wiping us. See like this thing over here that says what, Alor or whatever his name is? Uh, it says the Blades of Anguish and Suffering? Yeah. I think that's the, the rogue weapon quest. And you get these little symbols that drop off these mob and forest outside and in here. Turn them in, you get a yellow weapon, and then you have to do some more quests to upgrade that. Oh, you but all throughout this dungeon, there's little stations like that where you see the weapon. You know, they had they had a similar um, couple of dungeon to EQ2 that reminds me of. Not, it doesn't sound like it's exactly the system you're talking about, but similar. Yeah, you gotta have support classes. I agree, chat. If you want, if you want a really in-depth game, you need some support, or your game has to be designed around needing support. Is what I meant to say. I really like these skeleton models. I think they nailed it. What? You don't want a game where everybody can tank and you don't need a healer? Oh, no crowd control. Right. Just zerk everything. Yeah, that was a pop that was getting popular for a while. Did we? We didn't get turned around. This is new, right? Oh yeah. Okay. It's All new. right. We're going down even there. deeper. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of. Oh, there's a named. Where'd you see that at? There's multiple levels in these elevators. Oh wow! How cool. Yep. Got two. Get the green one first. I think you're all gonna leave me die down here. No, I'm down here too. Oh, okay, it's glitch. Nathan, are you on the, uh, the elevator? No. No, I'm down here. Okay. I'll pull him over here, so, so we don't have the elevator glitch, maybe? Yeah, we're all down here. Did anybody notice if we got that message saying, don't report bugs here or whatever? Did anybody notice that? I didn't I see it. So. Okay. This is still the Tomb of Lord Zhang. Still part of the Master Zen. Okay. Imagine this with the casters nuking you. Oh, I can't wait. And then live, these archers actually would move away and stand back and range attack you. We got a patrol coming. It's a four dot. Oh, they got a they got one back here, another four dot. It's on the disciple. A couple more levels, the disciple could solo in here. Oh, 
four dot patrol at that. Yeah. I miss MMOs where genuine fear was a thing. Yeah. You know? Oh yeah. The very idea of going to Dire Lands in Asher's Call used to fill me with dread. Or the kick in the gut of knowing you had a two hour corpse run ahead of you to get your gear back. Yeah. Oh. I've been the two nights of oh right. oh it's Sang Sang Icon. Okay, never mind. I thought it was a boss. There's several of those. Never mind. There's something happening up there though. Yeah, I think that's the caster um, weapon quest area up there it's for focus. But there's a name up there. Oh no, he stopped short. Yeah, I was about to say that too. This is a room where we could just camp here, if we wanted to. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Uh, Matthew, I think it is, man. I, I have to definitely say I think this game is some of the more unique and, and, and similar to Pantheon kind of gameplay you can get out there. Because it's made by Brad McQuaid. It's his last game. Sure, this isn't the, his... This isn't a perfect emulation of the server yet. It's an alpha. But even the alpha version of this server, I think it's about as close as we can possibly get to a, to a Pantheon-type experience in, to, in 2020. We got three. This would be only be better if I had a size screwed up me about breaking mess. Name also. Make that a five. I must have a Diagro, I must have a Diagro. My two uh, threat generators miss a ton, man. Like, it feels very broken. Like, they miss, like, at least 50% of the time. Do they miss that much on equal level mobs? Yeah. I swear, I think it might be a little broke. Oh, you're a plow pouting. What kind of 
taunts do you really have? No, uh, smite and uh, guardian assault, which is my sword smash. That's it. I was talking about verbal insults. No. Oh, 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 I see, I see. Yeah, probably. No fiend, I shall bless you. <laughs> That's the same name again, just FYI. Oh, it sure yeah. is. Oh, no way. My uh, Diagro is not good yet. <laughs> That's okay. That was I mean, we're Not surviving. Bad. We're doing great, so it doesn't yeah. really matter. Yeah, that's correct, Matthew. Make sure you get the launcher and the actual client. You need both. All right, where is there another path down here? Or have we come to the end? On this path. I wish we could get the gold. Yeah, me too. I noticed somebody was asking a, a minute ago about what classes and races are playable. Um, so, go, go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. I was going to say, most, most of the class, all the classes are playable. I would say the the ones that appear to be the least implemented would be probably Bard. There's a pretty important thing from Ranger missing. They're they're supposed to have the ability to make their own arrows somehow. Ooh, I got not, then we got ads back here too. Something about their arrow making ability seems to not fully implemented. I don't know the class well. And all the classes have some things that don't work, like um the Paladin uh, normally has an ability that makes their DPS crazy for a little while. They can kind of grab all the aggro with it real fast. It doesn't work. It, it actually it says it doesn't. But they mostly work, though. Yeah. Yeah, for the most part, yeah. It's enough to get by and play, for sure. All races are in. Um, very few of them have their racial ability work that works, but their races are in. And I think two of the the racial starting areas aren't implemented. But most people play on the island because you get the Pegasus at the end. Yeah, yeah. I, I do highly recommend starting on the aisle. The gear, all the quests are in. Get the Pegasus and the cloak at the end. Has a good horse starter dungeon. I oh, yeah. Said, especially if you've never played the game before. Yeah, yeah. And then you're picking up the and kind of learning as you go. Unlike me, I played the game for the years, and I just kind of flying a bunch of abilities. I did not remember having this many abilities. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go around. It's been too long. My, my memory is not as trusty as it used to be, apparently. Learn how to make macros. Yeah, I haven't yeah, looked into true. that yet, either. Yeah. 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 where macros work, I can not get those work no, I haven't tried any of that actually. Um, if you look in the the channel here on yeah, Discord. So yeah. I pulled up my I looked at that and I pulled up my old list. And maybe they're not implemented yet. I don't know. For they used to have them set up for weapon switching and chaining a bunch of abilities, you know? It'd be like where and then cast, 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 and for some reason it's I'm getting a lot of error flags trying to implement those. So I haven't tried any of the where yet. Ones, yeah, if anybody gets the where ones, where it is, you can I'll play with it. Let's see.
Yeah, we're going back. I didn't see any other way to go. Back in Which that one? room. But there are other things here. Just, uh, I think that was all for this level. Or this part. I want to say there's like four or so of these elevators. Maybe five. Somewhere. It's... Yeah, Kevin. So not everything works. But a, a, enough works. To have fun. Definitely enough works. There's a name on the ledge. Oh, no. It's... And now it's on the elevator. Come on. Invisible. I jumped off to check out the ledge real quick. I'll be right up. All right. But it says we're in combat, so I can't get him in horse. What about now? Or are you stuck in combat? Hey, Black Phantos! Welcome, man! Uh, Black Phantos just became a member of the Napalm. Welcome, welcome, my friend. So, um, just so you know, Black Phantos, uh, you can go on the page. Obviously, you might have already done that. You can look at some of the benefits. Uh, but one of the cool ones is that you can, you can pick a game I stream. Like last Wednesday, if it's a weird game that I wouldn't normally play, then I'm going to play it on Wednesday, because that's Weird Wednesday where I play a game maybe not so normal. Um, please don't make me play a weird game, though. Please don't make me do it. Unless you like to just see me play a weird game, and that's fine. But I played City of Heroes last Wednesday, and that was probably the most awkward stream I've ever done Somebody make him that play that damn Pokemon game. <laughs> I've already played it. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, it's it's hardly an MMO. If you, it's like a single player Pokemon with other single player people running around. Oh, yes, so. <laughs> yes, yes. Have you ever played Ashron's Call? <laughs> I have not ever played Ashron's Call, ever. Yeah, we should check out the emulator, man. Now, I, that's a game I always heard was awesome. Um, never played it. Never played it. When, um, it, it, uh, it's more different than any other MMO you've played. It's just a whole different style. I, I believe it because, like, there's a man and a wife that used to be developers of that game, and they're the ones running, uh, what's the new, newer, Project Gorgon. And that is a weird freaking game, dude. Right. So, I, a lot of people are saying, like, yeah, it's got that kind of sense of humor, and... Uh, for Masheron's call. We got a couple of mobs here. Yeah. They, uh, some of them ran from over there. I would give anything to have an AoE. Anything. <laughs> I would give anything. <laughs> Seriously, who is, like, the AoE class? I heard it was Warrior. Is that true? Uh... Maybe. Oh, we got another one. Oh my god, guys. We're gonna get killed! Well, yeah, we lost our disciple. The disciple's so, like, dead. Let's see, can I get out of the combat house somehow? Possible. Woo! I'm glad we died in that dungeon. To be honest with you, it's about time. <laughs> it's about
about time we that we died in a dungeon. Flying over to the Tomb of Lord Sang right now. I don't know how to get in there. Well, don't worry. We, we have to get back in, too. Need to see it. Yep. Yeah. If you fly up to what looks like kind of a bell towerish looking thing, meet us up by the yellow guy that's off to, let's say, west side of it. The west side of the chunk? Or the... No, like at the actual tomb on the west side of the top, not the top layer, but I was describing. If you look at the tomb as a castle, when you're at the very top of about resembles kind of like a bell tower, not all the way on the top of the mountain. But if you okay. meet us at the, the yellow NPC. And yes, yes, your gator bait. We're, uh, we've been doing the uh, tomb of Lord saying we, we got, we got slaughtered. Uh, suddenly the mobs just kept coming at us, but. That's what we're doing tonight. It is a cool dungeon, man. I like it. So far, every single dungeon we've done, and we pretty much ran a dungeon every night, um, it has its complete unique feel to it, you know? I was just about to say, there's, uh, at least in my opinion, there's not a dungeon in this game that was, wasn't cool. Yeah. I mean, I mean the, whole, the entire land mass is just it's completely unique as far as I'm concerned. Never really played oh. any MMO like it. What's that one? I can't remember what level it is, but it's in Qualia. Qualia, whatever the hell it is. Can't and it's like sirens inside of it. And you go down through the tubes. Oh, it's over by Dark Horse it's Downs. West, it's on the west side, right? Yeah, it's like the walk man that was hang on. Oh, what level was that? We gotta go there next. Yeah, that is a very cool map. It's right on the coast, right? Yeah, it's it's very probably weird, one, the, man. Like, one of the most like... originals. Um, those are continents. Um, Let's see. The Thestra, Kojin, and Qualia. Those are uh, the continents. Somebody's getting attacked by that name. Strand and Port, right? Oh, or it's Strand. a freaking name. Yeah, it's over there. It's over by Dark Horse Downs on the coast. I'm trying to remember what damn level that was, because that was so cool. You know what else I just realized? One of the auras I've been trying to use isn't even available. I, I, this whole time I thought I'd been activating it. Give me one second. Let me, uh, let me see if one of the others is. It's like north... East of Lair of Greenwich. There we go. There we go. That helps with threat right there. Cool. <sighs> okay. We're missing somebody. Evening, guys. Hey. 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 Oh, now we're all here. I thought somebody was coming doing it. I am actually kind of looking at my abilities. I think I see you guys coming. No, it's a little foggy at the moment. Standing on top of the mountain here, right on the where little park is just getting caught short. The stream, I saw you guys on stream, but I can't completely get put there. We're at the top. Well, we shoot him an invite, probably. Help. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's definitely up. Uh, in game. There we go. There we go. There we go. We still got room for one more if there's anybody in the game around our level. 15 to 18 ish. Hello, Winter. Welcome. Alright, guys. We gotta calm down. My wife just entered the chat. I gotta calm down. I'm gonna decline that summit <laughs> just because I wanna wanna come in naturally. There we are. There you are. Nice. Like the mount, man. Like, yeah, my gripping. It's a little fancier than the one I had years ago, but close enough. 
All right, my half hour is just a mess of abilities. So. Hey, look, it's a real tank. <laughs> oh no, God, it's a real noob. I got locked out. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna try to hold him from here. Stuff. Two more words I Actually, it's killing us, but yes. <laughs> is that that door just opens and closes randomly? Is that how that works? Yeah, yeah evidently. That's funny. Real tank. I'm the one who pulled him, and I didn't. Hit, I was holding that girl. <laughs> I'm still like mousing over my abilities like okay, which ones generate hey, where's my I, I think I just now tonight found out how I'm supposed to be holding aggro <laughs> I think I, I just figured it my, out uh, Reactions here. There's oh no. Ch there's chain attack counter and rescue. Oh, okay God, it's, it's been so long. Oh my god. The nostalgia is real Oh, there's one coming around this side. I'm gonna go ahead and pull him Whoa. Do we have all our buffs? No. Ah. Okay, orders and commands. I gotta remember which ones. Most of them aren't in some of them. I did notice that when I was trying to cast them in town when I got them, but they seem to be working. Some of them seem to be working out. Is that better? George. Uh oh. Piling up on us. You guys still have room for one more? We do. Will you uh, drop your name in the guild chat real quick? I guess you don't have to say your name, but just say invite in the guild. I crashed. Uh-oh. Best and the better arrows. Do we need to come back up for you? Well, let's go get him. Yeah, yeah, let's I go back. I can find you. I'm in stealth mode. I can... There you are. Heard that, David? 
Make sure when you guys get on that you uh, slash three for world chat and ask for an invite to the uh, Knights of Napalm. Oh, got one. I know, dude. I think it's broke. I swear. The disciples just really OP, dude. I, it's impossible yeah. to pull aggro off of them. I'm trying. I did get my withdrawal, so I got a group command when a command is given. Your ally will withdraw, and all attackers will flee. That's when I. How do I do the um, offensive target? Just pick them. You just click them, and then you can click anything else, and it remembers the last. Uh, defensive you clicked you know what i'm saying so if you click one of us and then you go ahead and click a mob it'll remember the last defense okay oh i'm dead oh what happened uh -oh. i crashed and then when i came back in the mobs were up oh i thought you were back with us dude they respawn that quick wow they do oh my god I'm glitching. I'm trying. Okay, now I can see the mob. Yeah, the floor keeps disappearing. I'm afraid to move. It looks like one of the mobs just closed up by you guys. Yeah, I can't see anybody now. Yeah, I can't either. I'm at the top of the. Uh, yeah. yeah, walk back that. Walk back that way, and we can see you again. There you are. There we go. And there's probably absolutely, like, hardly anybody probably watching the stream that doesn't know what I'm about to tell you. But just in case you don't know, I recently, for the first time ever, downloaded uh, Project 1999 just to see uh, what it what it's like. Holy crap, dude. There's, mm -hmm. there's so many things in, in Project 1999 that I forgot ever even existed in EverQuest. Um... Well, that is a joy, man. If you really want to feel like you went back in time. And there is a crap load of people playing that game, dude. They were every There's people everywhere. I was fighting for mobs outside of Kinos. You know what I'm saying? There are people everywhere. Were you on that, that new server they created? I was. I think so. The green one, I think it's called? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Did you ever play uh, P2002? I've not. I've never played any of the EQ uh, emulators. Yeah, that one went to Planes of Power. Hey, what's up, Miltus? Yeah, we're doing another dungeon, man. Another dungeon. Another mob I don't have aggro of. Don't worry, I have it for you. <laughs> we got two tanks tonight, guys, so... All right. Correction, Nathan, we have one and a half tanks. <laughs> I'm struggling over here. It's hard, dude. Tanking is hard in the current in the current stage of the server. It is. None, a lot of my abilities just aren't working. Yeah. There's a uh, monk disciple blade staff here. I literally like 20 minutes ago figured out how to hold aggro. <laughs> What's and really crazy is my uh, chain reaction aggro uh, pull isn't working as well, which is that one usually insta insta pull. Right. I have this with, uh, ability called withdraw, so I got to do is ta uh, target one of you guys, and it's automatically gonna pull them off you, but not so much. Just say something bad about his mother. <laughs> Did you say something bad about Ma Palm?
Uh, Milta says he's going to be joining. I'm going to be joining your guild. I'm going to roll a cleric or shaman. I love it. Cool. Shaman uh -oh. are really cool in this game also. Uh-oh. Oh, oh he was dead. He was dead. Okay. <laughs> Oh, got another one. They're coming back. And another one. Oh, crap, guys. That did not work well. That was completely my fault. I lost aggro without even... It's alright. It's alright. If we can keep them off of the uh, Disciple. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Don't let the Disciple die! I'm trying so hard to get it off of you, Zay. I know, me too. <laughs> I've never fought so hard in my life. Gorilla glue has stuck. One is off. Nope, he went right back. Oh, I, yeah, man, what's going It's not working. Oh, I've got no energy left. Yes, Swipper, this is a private server. Uh, VG. Emu. It's the only way to play Vanguard in 2020. Literally. Literally, yep. And it is an alpha. It's not perfect, guys. Not perfect. It's still better than most everything on the market today. Yeah, easily. Some of the, uh, some of the, uh, nice, wonderful awesome people who are making this server possible um they really want me to make it clear to anybody jumping on to the game not to come in here expecting like everything to work um because it is an alpha it's and there's it's not a finished project product right uh coin is back sorry man i forgot that when you get kicked you gotta be Reinvited. It's cool. I just uh, want to see if I could find you. Luckily, you were at the entrance. Ooh, let's try corpse drag. Slash corpse drag. Ah, no, it's not working. My EXP's back really blown. Oh, you know what? I think it's because somebody's got to release the corpse or allow friends to drag corpses, something like that. Slash yeah, I don't know. And, and then, then play your name. There it is. Everybody come this way because all those guys are going to pop any second. Pull them into this hallway. Already got There's one. one. Yep. There's two. They're coming. Here they are. Oh boy. Thank you, Swipper. No, they don't. So basically, all these mobs are just auto attacking. Yeah, that's why the that's why the difficulty is a lot lower. It's one of the main reasons. And we still wipe twice. Yes, yes, isn't it awesome? <laughs> Living the damn dream. Yeah, if all the abilities were turned on, I don't think we could be in here just level. No, no. He must be dead. I'm gonna oh, assume. I didn't realize, yeah, we're a few levels below everything. <laughs> uh, if you play it to yourself favor and don't use GM commands, you will ruin your journey experience. I agree, Militus. So there are commands. Um, I recommend using them to level down and then back to where you was if you want to play with the low level friend. Um, or if you get to a dungeon like, man, I really want to do this dungeon, but I'm kind of hi too high level to enjoy it. Make yourself lower than what the, like this is a level 20 dungeon. So we're running it at, you know, 15, 17. And it's fun. If we ran it at 20, 24, we'd be blasting through it too quickly. So that's, that's how I recommend using that. If you want a really fun experience. Now, if you just want to get in here and see what the game has to offer and you're, you don't plan on being here for long, you know. 
have at it. Do whatever you want, you know? I'm not going to tell you how to play the game, but I'm just saying, if you don't want to spoil it and ruin it, definitely just level up naturally. Way more fun. So when I first started, I think it was about two months ago now, I twinked the heck out of a bunch of characters. I went back and detwinked them all because I ruined it for myself. Yeah. Yeah, I started to do that and I realized I, how boring it was. And my justification at the time was, the only way I was going to see the group content is to go in there with a solo class, I'll twink down and do it. Which is true, it was fun, yeah. but this is way more fun like this. I agree. And plus, sometimes you have to use the commands because stuff isn't technically in the game yet. Like, apparently there is a raid zone. I was talking to a guy uh, who's on the server yesterday, and he told me there is a raid zone in the game. However, you have to use a command to get in there. Uh, but once you do, you can you can do the raid bosses and everything. Yeah, each important raid house. Yes, yes. Thank you. Can I get rebuffed, please? Thank you, thank you. So can you get the ships? Not yet. Man, I want to yeah, They don't have crafting finished up yet. Yeah. Yeah, but once they get crafting up and working, I'm gonna go nuts. So I saw some of the boat parts on, uh, what's it called? That vendor. Anyway, the vendor you can get all the, the, the equipment and stuff off of. That's supposed to be like the auction house. But I don't remember what's all needed and if all of them are there. And I don't remember how to recombine them, but I saw some of the boat parts on. Guys, come get your XP back. Oh, crap. Tombstones. That's where we died. Classic. Macro target next corpse. Corpse drag. Prince and repeat. Mine's stuck on the elevator. Yes, Miltus, the, uh, this, this guy with the, uh, the disciple with this little logo here, uh, that's our healer. From my perspective, disciple is a unique healing class. Why in the world? Oh, no. What about Blood Mage? Everybody says Blood Mage was, uh... They are. The Blood Mage kind of reminds me of the Rift uh, Chloromancer. Oh. Kind of. Disciples make me think of uh, Warhammer, uh, the war the Warrior Priest. Said I play Warhammer. I know what you're talking about, yeah. The Priest of Sigmar dudes? Yeah. Uh, they were the Empire healers, right? Yeah, I mean, they're yeah. just, they're melee healers, that's all it is. Yeah. They do damage, uh, they like get in there and do damage so that they can heal or something. I don't remember exactly. It was a cool class, though. Yes, and exactly, the, uh, Miltus, exactly. Disciples of Cain on the other side, same thing. Right. Who's the pistol welding uh, healer in uh, Star Wars The Old Republic? They're pretty cool too. Uh, Andrew, sometimes the, the launcher has to be uh, closed and reopened. Even try restarting the computer if you're having trouble with the launcher. Yeah, that was my fault. Already, I got the second place in the, the, the uh, basement there. Dreads work. Somebody have a res or done Well, we lost the Disciple too, didn't we? No? The Disciple should have a res. They have it yet? Yo, I gotta let my dogs oh. out anyway. They're looking at me like, what are you doing? 
<laughs> We're playing a very old classic game, guys. Where did he die at? Right up on. Okay, we need to go back up. Yeah, the elevator apparently there was uh, three levels to it, and I stopped at the second one, and you guys went down to the bottom. Okay. That was my fault. <laughs> so, how big can a group be in this game? Six. 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 <laughs> Damn. Y'all are full. Right now, yeah. See, I see the corpse right here. Oh, yeah, he is. On mine, he's uh, on the platform. He's on the elevator, yep. This elevator's super glitched, though. <laughs> it's like it's some weird teleportation device. I do remember elevators, even in the waning days of the game, still being a little bit hitchy, where people kind of flick around and whatnot. Yeah. And uh, by the way, um, Militus says that class you were talking about in Star Wars was uh, called the Smuggler. Ah, oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, they could the heal? The Scoundrel could. Oh, the Scoundrel, okay. Because I played yeah, the, the subclass of the Scoundrel. Was it? Yeah, it was yeah, yeah. pistols, right? Well, um, the Scoundrel was the Smuggler one, and then there was one that was uh, like a, one of the Bounty Hunter ones had dual pistols you could use the heal. I think that was Gunslinger. No, I'm talking about on the uh, Empire side that one of the uh, the bounty hunters could heal, and he used dual dual pistols. As, but so did the gunslinger. But uh -huh. gunslingers were pure pure DPS. Okay, we're on the bottom floor off the elevator, right? Yep. Yep. You guys keep progressing. I'll uh, do uh, an aggro off and catch up real quick. Oh, never mind. Fantastic, alright. Whoa, falling through the wall. <laughs> okay, I'm under the dungeon with my griffin. And my griffin is a very good swimmer. <laughs> so what dungeon are y'all in? Uh, Lord Zane. Yeah, Tomb of Lord Zane. Is somebody went AFK? Is that right? Or are we all here? We have one that fell through the world. Oh, no. I'm popped back out. I'll try to. You know what? Let me land before I accept that summon. Let's try this. Yeah. There we are. Now we're kicking the gas. Pop, pop. All right, you're back. Yes, he's, sir. Re he's returned from 50,000 leagues under the earth. Boys, boys, I need to make an announcement. There is now over 40 people on this server. And 39 of them are knights. <laughs> and the other one is a GM. Hold on. Hold on. I'm about to make 40. If this was a uh, PvP server, it'd be pretty interesting to someone rolling in that wasn't from our guild. <laughs> <laughs> Send them an invite. If they decline, kill them. Yeah. <laughs> I remember I used to, when I first went to PvP uh, with my rogue, hiding in Martok, killing my horse and turning off. <laughs> well, we can say with complete honesty, we are the largest guild in the city. Yep. Yeah, something you're trying to do, Halgar, apparently has not been implemented yet. <laughs> it, oh, keeps, yeah, it, it keeps telling me. <laughs> oh, it's popping up? Yeah, I've got bubbles turned on just for chat or for uh, the stream to be able to see what everybody's saying. Uh, okay. And I'm, I'm just kind of clicking like a madman, too. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I've been doing. Now I've got like a few abilities I know does hate, and I'll pretty much just spam them. I mean, I tried to organize a little bit, but really I just bought them and then flew over to you guys. Uh, I got a couple of them lined up. But I'm, I'm also burning through my mana way for the win. Do you have the, uh, I can't remember what it is on, but it's a little buff and it has a plus symbol on it. Do you have that running? I keep turning on power attack, yeah. I, I'm yep. forced to have it. I gotta keep that off. <laughs> yeah, that'll that'll burn through it. So 
don't know me yet. Yeah, and I, man, I just wish I had, uh, and I think I have it written down in a notepad file. My old, like, macro. You know, when you, when you got to the point where you're clicking one or two log macros and it can bring everything in it. Yeah, oh, check, man, check those macro know. pins, man. They explain how to set it up. I just, well, my thing is I gotta remember which, which was which, because I do have some cast ones where it's cast, cast, cast. Yeah, it's alright. Hey. Well, the way those macro guides work is it explains what order you should put what in. Does it, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It doesn't tell you put this ability and then this ability. It says here's the logic behind how you decide what uh -oh. ability. Got three. Holy hell. Let me see if I can off tank one of these there. Rayco, I'm going to try to pull that one up, too. Yeah, I'm holding, blocking down one myself. Okay, I've got one. There we go. All right. Thank you. Ah, uh, when my third fight has a tank, you feel discouraged. Like, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> the more I can get to come at you, the better. <laughs> I just dragged that power attack one. Right out of the way, so <laughs> yeah, really helping. makes a big difference. Oh, we're gonna outgive this ad coming here. My Diagra is not in. Uh, yeah, not to uh, use it anyway. You know, I'm gonna, <laughs> I gotta try to get my withdrawal working here. Yeah, I should, I should be working better. Wow, I kind of respawned real quick over there. Heck yeah. Oh, oh crap. Oh, All four. Oh. Oh, this'll be fun. Assist, assist, assist. No way, they went for the Disciple. Okay, I got one off the Disciple. Here, I'll sit here and tank the name, it'll be fun. Oh my god, I pulled him off the Disciple, guys! That... That is the most exciting thing! Screenshot, screenshot! Who's <laughs> <laughs> gonna believe you? I'm holding aggro! Off of the Disciple! Uh, we have to check that stream and, and really analyze this a little bit. I think the Disciple <laughs> fate death. Dude, don't worry, that's gonna be a replay, you know, freaking uh, selected, highlighted part of the stream. Uh, yeah, the Disciple fate death, I see it now. <laughs> oh, man. Check the logs. Okay. All right, so I used a geom command. All right, we got a. Oh wait, we already got the name. Right. I tanked that name the whole time on a rogue and held better aggro than you did, Nathan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm running around. I'm like, can I get somebody to attack me here, please? Come on now. What if I even have one? I can't actually pull any of them. 
That's the very definition of a meat shield. Yeah, I'll start off with the aggro, that'll make me feel better. The one thing I really like about this emulator in live game, you are very restricted on what class you can be based on race. The way it's set up. Any race, any class, which I love. Yeah. Got my request one barbarian rogue action goal. You know, one thing I really hate is when they change the character models without warning, and my, my lesser giant did not look quite as cool as he used to. I was like, what the heck? There's no bald one anywhere either. I, I had a big bald lesser giant goatee. He's completely obnoxiously oversized. And I always love that about, you know, the classic MMOs that actually have different character size models and whatnot. We'd all be standing next to each other after raids taking screenshots. We got my big yeah. movie in it. <laughs> Uh, GNL, I heard there are some UIs. I haven't played around with any of them. Um, yeah, I'm just trying the basic. Is what is it? Uh, what, it's called Drox is one of the ones. Does it work? Damn you, Cal. Yeah, on the, uh, forums they have a Some sort of. Hey, Magra. Oh, I almost had it for a minute. He's like, you wanted to come after me. Is there a quest to get in there or something? Is it like gated? No. No. But you can't just walk in the front. You gotta walk around and up some stairs to get to the uh, top. And then there is a gate, but you just wait a little while and it opens. Like a actual iron... It's literally gated. Right. <laughs> you just... You don't have to do anything to, uh... But wait for the gate to open. Oh, there we go. There we go. Right? Could you imagine if this town was live, like... We wouldn't have to go anywhere, you just spawn the boss and stuff over and over again. Oh, uh, you know what, since I can't hold aggro, I have just the offensive stance. You probably might be able to hold aggro that way. Yeah, he has no problem holding it. In the past, when I had my chain attacks, that actually did work. I'd, I'd start the battle in offensive stance. I'd yep. uh, do a massive attack with my decimate and then switch over to defensive. Yep. That's good to know. What were you saying about looting? If you loot the guy, it'll probably start the respawn timer. So if you loot a bunch of guys all at the same time, it won't respawn all the same. Oh. You know, if you leave, let a guy, you know, be there dead for a while, you know, it'll probably, you know, you well, can that's stagger. Well, that works. I do remember that used to be in a thing. Yeah. Like, they're just, like, I don't remember looting, uh, Rubicon, and he just disappeared, and now he's back, like, less than two minutes later. Well, hell, loot faster. <laughs> and here I got my target next uh, corpse loot all macro and I'm gonna use it. Wait, what is awareness? It just said my awareness skill increased. Yeah, it's, it's just like leveling you see up. Yeah. Wherever you see it, wherever there's invis mobs. Oh, there's a lot of it. Oh, I'm under attack. Oh no, my awareness increased a bit too late. 
<laughs> oh wow, yeah, I remember that. Yep. It's go. those wolves over in the forest, I'm assuming. It was, it was a statue. You suddenly become aware that there's a knife in your back. You know, your awareness does heighten in danger. Think about when you're driving, here's kind of your mind's drifting, and then cop lights go up behind you. You're the most aware person ever suddenly. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> so it kind of makes sense. I, I just get that crappy feeling in my stomach, too. God damn it. Got a wandering little guy right here. Real friend stab you in the front. <laughs> Ruby Sentry, unless I bugged out. Well, the way this game is well, the spit duct tape it's made out of, that's a distinct possibility. <laughs> No. Is that isometric? No, it's the card Hearthstone Magic card game spin-off that the people from who made Legion of Le League of Legends made. Right. Got it. Okay. I've been playing it all weekend. It's so good. Like, it's shockingly good. Is it an online card game basically? Uh-huh. side of the room. Beautiful, just leveled up. Nice. I've gained about a level and a half tonight in this dungeon. Oh, you had the uh, rest bonus, right? Yeah, I did. I did. Yeah. Very nice. In your last stream, your experience games were incredible. How are they this evening with the mobs at a higher level? Um, so we were a lot level, uh, lower level when we were streaming before, uh, and, and and tonight all the way up until recently I had rest experience. So as you can see, we just killed one mob and that was about one percent. So yeah, that's I about right. Buffed. I have no. But then again, we are uh, level below. I got seven point nine three percent during. Uh, Alright, okay. Militus, thanks okay, for joining thanks. us. Um, 
Well, that was definitely fun. I gotta do some oh, stuff hello. around the house. And oh, so okay. I'm not gonna hold up a spot here. I think we got somebody else in line to get in, right? Uh, Probably, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, alright. Oh, yeah. Oh, Grifka's, yeah. We can get Grifka in, that's right. Well, thanks for playing with us, man. Oh, absolutely. Thanks for having me, man. Thanks for, again, thanks for getting people back into the Vanguard, even if it's just a little tied us over until uh Pantheon. Right, God, right. Alpha better come quick. Like I I I want it. So what did bad. did you guys hear what Joppa said in the last stream? He said what? he said uh on our march to Alpha. That sounded like a beat yeah. dropping. He really did yeah. hesitate. He was like March to Alpha. Don't we have pre alpha 5 yet or menu before then? Well, they can't even discuss it if they open it up. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, if they're trying to still do testing, if there's critical issues, I'm sure they're going to tell, they're not going to announce that they're doing pre alpha 5. Right. Unless you've done the pre purchase to get onto the forums. If there's critical issues going on, they want everyone to just shut up about it. Right. Okay, I think I'm at the temple of Lord Jang and I'm under attack. Eh. We'll, we'll have to come back to you to, to get you down here, for sure. Or turn okay. aggro off. Yeah, uh, dot aggro space off. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Run your foot down and then turn it back on, yeah. Oh, my aggro is now off. And, oh, it doesn't help against the people who are still chasing people. I'm <laughs> press your aggro. Run away! Run away! Oh, boys, it just rifted the new uh, target or man. I don't remember this long walk up these steps. <laughs> Are you a uh, dire lord? Of course. All right. All right. Am I anywhere near you? Oh, oh, hold on. I'm at this. Looks like an elevator. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yes. Come on down. Yep. Okay. So how do I how do I get in here? Um. If you stand on it, it'll eventually bring you down. We gonna head back that way. That way we can. No, yeah, we got to. There's find something it. inside a glass case. Oh no! You need to go around. There's a there's another path that goes up and around. Oh, I need to go up the mountain. I can just fly up there. Probably if you're standing there looking at something that looks like a door, but it's encased in glass. Yeah. Uh huh. Fly one level straight above you. There's a stairs around the backside. Right. We're headed okay. back up that way, too. Alright, let me turn off my... I think I just sort of flew through it. It looks like I might be on some sort of elevator. The floor keeps disappearing. I don't know. Round thing circular goes up and down? Uh, round thing circular, it just sort of phases in and out while it's going down. Okay, I missed it. Alright, it just sort of kept phasing from existence now. I'm worried about stepping on it. Do it! So are they dropping some decent equipment? Because I still have, like, my tutorial I keep trying to get rid of. Yeah, there's been quite a few drops tonight. Awesome. I do feel like the dungeons drop, uh, way better. Oh, the, that dungeon we were in, what was it? They awesome. Yeah. Got Kager's end? Yeah, man. Where's that at? Which one's that? That's the one we were in the That's other day. The dwarves. Oh, yeah. that one. That was a good one, yeah. Go, they were dropping like all night. Got to a point I didn't even care anymore. <laughs> you know, there's oh, so much. Magicked me here to the bottom. Oh, I there know. you go. You're here. Do you have an AoE? Me? No. Nobody has one. None of the tanks. No, it's so strange to not. I know I'm gonna get one later. I there's gonna be an AOE lifesteal, a code. Okay. Yep. Funnel. Monk has an AOE. Okay. Yeah, Monk's awesome. Yeah, 
You know it's weird if you AOE uh if you search AOE and Vanguard, like you get like no hits. So it's, it's, <laughs> it's not what it was known for. Monks were never very amazing at Soul. Nathan, we should go up and find the hard rare. Go where? We should go up and find the hard rare. Okay, what's it? Hey everybody, first. jump on the glitch baiter. Here we go, the glitch baiter. Long computer, I'm better. Does anyone else see Zyana dead? Yeah. <laughs> Fang death. Is that Fang death? I assume so. Are we here? Yep. Yep. Okay. Everyone off the elevator. I love how getting out and everyone's freaking out. I think again. have an AOE attack? I... Tell me about the, the mobs? Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a bunch of us. My, my melee weapons are a lot better than my bow. <laughs> so. Nice. Hey, what's back around this corner? I think that's the direction. Oh, it's another elevator. I think we got an add on this too. Oh, I lost my freaking buff too. Do we have a bard in the party? No. No. Okay, because it looked like someone, when that buff went off, it looked like uh, a couple of people were paying guitars. Yeah, it does that for the ranger buff. Yeah. Oh, interesting. You all play air guitar. <laughs> nice. Jukebox hero. Wild stallions! Nice. Bird! So you want to try to go up here? Yes. Yeah, my shielding, my my aura of shielding suddenly doesn't work, guys. So, uh, not gonna be able to hold aggro again. Wait a minute, did you? Yeah, I was about oh, to say that, that thing has changed. I know, but it was it was on before, and now it's off again. <laughs> it, it worked for like thirty minutes. Air quotes worked. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Then I will target Zolana for my blood sacrifice here. You say the silliest thing. You really know how to impress a girl. I try. I keep forgetting how dangerous that shadow step is. <laughs> what 
you zorked through a wall. <laughs> I've done it plenty of times where I just have to quit the game or unstuck, use the unstuck command and it sends me all the way back to town. Right. On mine, my favorite was I sat inside the wall, found a way to seat inside the room again, and when a mob spawned, I targeted him and zorched right back out of the wall. That was classic. <laughs> yeah, I had to do that last time. Yeah, it was fun. Once the 30 second cooldown was done, I just warped back out and attacked some small crazy person. Yes, that's true, chat. Uh, if you want to check out how to get on the private server that we're playing on, which is the only way to play Vanguard, then uh, check out my uh, Vanguard Rally Up video. I have all the links in the description, everything you need. Um, and yeah, uh, no problem, uh, Necros. Uh, glad to bring uh, a little love to Vanguard. My pleasure. Oh! Oh no! I just yeeted myself into the ceiling! <laughs> <laughs> okay, leave one of them alive if you can. I'm okay. gonna... I don't even know where we all are. Hold on. Too late. Oh, the target's too far away. I am on the top of the world! <laughs> what just happened? Yeah. You're, do, okay. Are you even in the dungeon, or does it show you... I'm, I'm in the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me take a screenshot. Where's my sniping? It's Griffica. I think if you just press the minor button on the keyboard, that's because the screen capture. Screenshots. What button? Is that? I, th I think it's the minus button. Zay dash. says they can. Uh, Zay says they can summon you. Get you back in here. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. Now I gotta find out what folder it went to. There we are. Okay, I'll put it in Discord. It's hilarious. I am. I There you go. Oh, nice. Hey, everyone, how's it going? <laughs> that, uh, that, uh, that never happened, I don't know. Are some of the stances in the game working, though? Anybody know? I don't know, my ranger stances don't seem to be working. Yeah. Yeah. You're talking about the different class stance? Right. Yes. My devious foe works and my stalking does the road. Um, I'd say a good portion of them actually work for character classes. What I've seen doesn't. Some classes have uh, abilities to push other mobs and characters out of stance. None of those seem Hey, there's a quest from the Mace of Sorrow here. Um, so, GNL asked a really good question. Uh, other than playing the emulator, what else can we as a community do to help the devs of BGOE move? So, uh, a couple of things that I'm aware of. Number one, I would highly recommend, especially if you know how to develop um, or uh, anything that might be actually helpful to getting the server moving along, to get on and contact them and, and maybe they have some things you could help with um beyond that uh as far as keeping the server up uh you can go to their official website and you can donate you know throw them a couple of bucks or what have you uh just to uh keep the service up now any of that money none of that money's going for them as an actual profit uh, all money is uh goes just goes to keep the servers running basically and that's that's the only two things i know of um you know, supporting the game, playing the game, um, helping keep the servers up, uh, and any, anything you can help with the actual development, um, any any skills or anything you might have. But you want to definitely contact if you wanted to help with anything like that. Get on their Discord and um, 
you know they got devs on there you could you could uh contact to see if there's anything you can do to help really good Unless, of course, you're working on pan. Get back to damn work. Yeah, get back to work okay. in that case, right. Are there any quests in here? Uh, there's quests that bring you into here, but we skip through pan. Okay. Oh, there's... There we go. Very awesome. You know, that's a good name for a metal band right there. Unholy Destroyer. <laughs> oh, yeah. This place is laid out just like that uh, dungeon on Isle of Dawn. Yeah. Yeah, it just has more layers. Yeah. I'm sure that was one order. way they uh, cut down the development time of these massive dungeons. Um. Vaughn, yes, you do have to download the, the uh, VGO Emu uh, Launcher. Um, if you need a link to that, it is in my Vanguard Rally Up video in the description. Another elevator up. This is where this takes us. Fight to the top. <laughs> How many people remember that old movie? Don't say things like that. It makes me feel old. <laughs> I am old. Same. Oh, hey. oh, oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not good, not good. Scary new things, scary new things. Oh my god, they're level 22. Heal me! Yes, this is why I wanted to come here. I've got the Phantasm, I think. No, We're no I don't. Heal. We're just glitching. Phantasm down. Woo, that was scary. Alright, alright. Oh, he had a tree symbol. I ain't freeing no ghost. Through the wall. Here he comes. This reminds me of that uh, uh, dwarf corpse in Unrest. The guy who's like in the closet. Oh, yeah. Alright. Thanks. Thanks, Caffeine. Having fun, man. Having a lot of fun. Alright, let's pop around here. Alright, this is a good spot right here. Till we figure this out. Oh, look at that mob. I hope you don't mind if I'm trying to take the, the loot here. Ugh, it's all level 18. Makes me sad. And that's a cool looking mob, dude. His animations are on point. I like. Alright, I got 30 minutes before I have to go. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take a break. Five in the morning. What do you think of that one? Like one of my favorite.
uh, Necro, so once you're in the game, uh, if you hit slash three, uh, you can ask for an invite, or if you just right there in the chat, just tell me your character's name, I'll send you an invite right now. I'm actually not sure, can you see world chat when we're in the dungeon? I don't even know if you can. Yes. Okay. Yeah, it should be. Nope, it's this format message, not. I see this. Somebody's. Yeah, some monk just. Yeah, I see that too. You guys saw it? No, we saw a monk that was looking for group in world chat, oh. though. Oh. So oh. we can't see it in the dungeon. Oh, you mean level 19? Are you asking if we want that person? Is that what you're saying? No, we're, we're seeing whether or not we can see world chat in the dungeon. Yeah, we definitely can. I'm seeing it now. Yeah. Slash three space. And then hit three. Oh no, it says for me format message does not exist. Okay, I'll just talk it up to the game game. Somebody wisely banned you from world chat. <laughs> Listen, it's not that I started a erotica um <laughs> fun fest, it's just I might have started a humble erotica fun fest. <laughs> you said that out loud. Oh my god, it, it was my pleasure and privilege to do so. <laughs> Add. Nope. Oh. And if you didn't start it, you sure in hell wish you did. Oh, I absolutely started it. Flanking either side of the door or mobs. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Those, yeah, those right there. I saw you running forward. I was like, maybe I should tell him, maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> yeah, I will. Too late. Let me stun one. Okay, cool. Let's stun one. So when you do the quest line coming here, the this end room we're heading towards is where you have to come back and forth to a couple times. Oh, okay. Yep. Yep. That's kind of annoying. Move on up to the sky to the east side. Got to get a piece of the fire. I don't even have my freaking haunt stance up, and I'm still pulling this people like crazy. Low level aggro. I don't know if it's in or not, I just... No, it would, but... it would make a degree of sense. Yeah, I just don't know if it's coded or not, but it makes sense. 
Oh, I got level 15 I didn't even realize it was. Dreads. I like how this guy's name is in all caps. And he's his his pips are gold. He's a five gold pip. So this guy here is the the final quest, dude. Oh, okay. Okay, that was really unimpressive for five gold pip. <laughs> well, like I said, they don't have their abilities. You guys got a quest from him? No, no, no. Okay. If we had done the quest, this is where it would be. I mean, that's a nice coffin. I gotta say. Okay, yeah, yeah, it's a little cheap for a loud one. We're calling it? No, I gotta go for a bit. I, I gotta feed my dog before he jumps up on my lap. My dog's 90 pounds, so I don't want that to happen. Mm. Alright, then I think on that note, I'm gonna head on out so I can get to bed early. Alright, uh, you guys... Hold on, Diamond Sentinel is back. Uh, let's get back up somewhere safe then. Yeah, we'll 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 get we'll get everybody somewhere safe, and then we'll uh, we'll call it a night. Well, if we go back here, nothing will aggro on us back here, and everybody can just call out. Okay. Good deal. Yep. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, thanks for playing, man. Blast. Do oh, another yeah. dungeon. Good time. I think I'm going to go see uh, what level that other dungeon is I was talking. Alright guys, um, hang on, let me get out of Discord so I'm not screaming in your guys' ear. Alright guys, thanks for joining me tonight on another dungeon run um, with Vanguard. Uh, really awesome game. Um, if you guys haven't already gotten on the game... Uh, I see that uh, Vaughn has some questions as to how to play the game or uh, how to how to get the game going. Um, there's a really good guide on their official website, um, and and if you need a link to get right to that guide, it is on my uh, Vanguard Rally Up video in the description. Uh, it has a, a guide there that kind of walks you through uh, some very simple steps. It's not it's not very complicated um, to help you get started and get you in the game. I do highly recommend it, especially if you're a Pantheon fan. And let's face it, if you're watching this channel, there's like a 99.9% .9 chance you are. This was Brad McQuaid's last uh, completely finished world. Awesome game. Now, now once again, though, uh, I do have to say that you got to come in with the right expectations. It is a, a, a an alpha state of a uh, private server. Uh, so, you know, you can't expect everything to work. <laughs> you kind of got to come in and be like, I just hope it's enough that I can play the game. And it is. Uh, there are some scenarios you will run into, uh, such as I couldn't turn on my uh, my ability that would allow me to create hate with everything I do. Um, but, you know, the the game works. We can have fun. We can group up. Um, just make sure when you get in, slash three for world and ask for an invite to the Nathan Napalm Guild, um, the Knights of Napalm. Because it just, it's easier for us to chat, get groups going, all that kind of thing. Uh, but the more the merrier... Come on in. We're having a blast exploring Brad's final world. Uh, I hope to see you in here soon. I play almost every day now. I'm not playing this hardcore because, you know, it's 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 an alpha state of a private server. Um, so I'm not playing like hardcore. None of us that I'm aware of are. A lot of people are logging on every day. There's constantly about 30, 40 people playing. So, um, you know, plenty of people to come in, uh, get you a group together, and have fun. And thank you, GNL, uh, for for coming and uh, hanging out with us and uh, and getting us and and, and and talking and chatting and all that kind of thing. But guys, come join the Knights of Napalm. We're having a blast. Uh, I think we're over a hundred deep right now uh, in the guild, if I'm not mistaken, something like that. Um, appreciate y'all coming out though tonight. And uh, I will be streaming uh, again on Wednesday. I'll be streaming uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance though. A really freaking awesome RPG. 
Uh, so kind of wanted to do a little a little game session of that. So join me then, and then I'll be back to streaming Vanguard on Thursday, and I'll be going out of town for the weekend. So unfortunately, I won't be able to stream over the weekend unless I get back a little early on Sunday. Guys, thanks for joining me today, and thanks for playing Vanguard and hanging out with me. And until next time, God bless, and happy gaming. Listen to what I say. I've been making videos all day. My friends all say I'm It's a video buffet. You can even hit replay. But please just subscribe. I can't even describe. Be a part of my tribe. I'll even offer you a prize. But just please just subscribe. And hit the bell notification too.